I spent the last 969 days 3D printing my invention. It's a steel water bottle that clicks open, but it does have a few problems, like the fact that I'm poisoning everyone because it's 3D printed. So I'll be analyzing three health hazards, starting with not actually a problem and going all the way up to this is actually dangerous. Starting with the material, I use polylactic acid, or PLA for short. It sounds scary, but it's actually made from corn. Synthetic dyes to change the color of the PLA could be added and would make it non-food safe, but luckily they do offer food grade certified options. And the nozzle that I use to melt the plastic is made of food grade stainless steel to keep the plastic free from contamination. Now even a professionally injected molded plastic part sheds a small amount of microplastic. Unfortunately, my 3D printed part sheds about 30 times that amount of microplastic. And look, obviously that's not ideal. Will all that plastic turn me into a sterile beta male? I don't know, but here's some context. Eating a meal wrapped in plastic wrap would be about 20 microplastic thingies. But before I get there, I need to tell you something. I don't have any actual customers yet. These 3D printed versions are just for prototypes. The real version will be professionally injection molded. So I'm just endangering myself and the small group of people who I have testing the bottle. 3D printers print plastic one layer at a time. And even though it feels smooth, it creates tiny little ridges. And especially when combined with a moist, damp, dark environment of inside a water bottle, it provides the ideal growth environment for bacteria. Luckily, I developed a very scientific way of testing if there's mold or bacteria in my water bottle. I'm constantly mashing together different cleaning potions, as well as just creating entire new prototypes to test when one gets too old. Look, I'm not a doctor, okay? 